फ्रेंड्स दिस इज मिस्टर राहुल होनकड़स असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर एंड वर्कशॉप सुपरिटेंडेंट फ्रॉम एन बी नवले सिंहगढ़ कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग केगाव सोलापुर माय क्वालिफिकेशन इज मैकेनिकल डिजाइन इंजीनियरिंग नाउ इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट अ नेक्स्ट चैप्टर दैट इज अल्टरनेटिव फ्यूल्स एंड इंजिन इमिशंस एंड इट्स कंट्रोल मेथड्स नाउ हियर वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द डिफरेंट अल्टरनेटिव फ्यूल्स विच इज यूज फॉर एस एंड सी ए इंजिन नो वी नो we are using petrol as a fuel for all sa engines and diesel as a fuel for uh, diesel engines or ci engines uh, the sources of this particular petrol or diesels are very much limited it may be over or it may be uh, finish within 10 to 20 years so there is a need to see the different alternatives of this particular fuels so there are different alternative fuels like compressed or natural gas ethanol methanol hydrogen biogas non edible oils lpg producer gas etc etc now one by one we'll understand which are the alternative fuels for sa engines and which are the alternative fuels for ci engines one by one now the different alternative fuels used for si engines generally alcohol is one of the very important alternative fuels this is to be considered most promising fuel for the future alcohols uh, alternative fuel has again two types one is a ethanol and another one is a methanol uh, the ethanol is nothing but its chemical name c2h5oh and methanol that is ch3oh ethanol and methanol are again two types of alternative fuels under the category of alcohol we know uh, we can get the ethanol from the sugar cane factory the sugar cane slurry we can get the ethanol nowadays uh, our government of india has decided uh, to add uh, at least 10% of ethanol in petrol itself so the use of ethanol is very very important then the second one the second alternative fuel that is for petrol that is biogas uh, we know uh, from biogas is generally produced by the dung from different beast as the cow buffalo goat sheep horse then donkey and elephant again the different sources like uh, the crop residue vegetable waste uh, Uh, then uh, algae uh, then poultry droppings pig uh, manure etc etc so it is again very important source that is nothing but biogas now again uh, we know the different composition and properties of biogas i am not again going in deep over here you can read it directly from the notes itself the third alternative fuel that is a compressed natural gas the cng is one kind of a petroleum product and we can get by drilling the wells sometime uh, in the earth crust or some time in the sea crust itself so it is also one kind of uh, very important uh, alternative fuels then after this uh, uh, the uh, lpg also comes under this particular uh, uh, category of uh, petroleum alternative fuel that is liquefied petroleum gas etc now the different emission levels and uh, the different pollutants level and uh, for uh, what level we can use the catalytic converter and uh, cng with the catalytic converter these things are present in this particular table itself then uh, about uh, the liquefied petroleum gas that is a uh, lpg it is also one kind of uh, uh, petroleum product uh, it is a mixture of uh, propane and butane uh, nowadays uh, generally we are using this particular uh, lpg in for, for domestic application we can use this lpg uh, for the alternative fuels as the alternative fuels in the engine itself after this uh, hydrogen is also one kind of alternative fuels nowadays in market the hydrogen cars are there the uh, the engines which can run on the both uh, like uh, on petrol as well as on uh, hydrogen itself so it is also one kind of uh, very important alternative fuel now these all are the different alternative fuels which are very much useful in the case of si engine now when we are talk about the alternative fuels for ci engine the vegetable oil is one kind of alternative fuel for the ci engine so the different uh, non edible vegetable oil or we can say the non vegetable uh, non edible oils like uh, jatropha then like uh, canola plants uh, extraction oils uh, we can make some blends and we We can use such kind of a blends along with the diesel and uh, that 
becomes a uh, uh, biodiesel we can say for the cns now to understand this we must have to understand what is the meaning of blending or the process of blending blending is nothing but by mixing of some product in some proportion to get a new product which has some different properties that process is nothing but called as a process of blending sometime we can say 30% biodiesel blend 20% biodiesel blend this comes under this process of blending so these are the different alternative fuels so here we stop in this video we'll see in the next video